Hello and welcome to the first episode of Squads for Cops. In this episode we will be building a bronze hybrid for the bronze bombers tournament. The squad we are building is a 4-2-2 K League combined with Scottish Premier League. So the backline, we have the Polish Serniak from Dundee United in net, then we have Fowler at right back, the bad pace but he makes up with the great defending and heading instead, and then we have Gunning, good pace, good heading, Not la he lacking out in defending but still a great defender, then we have Yoon from the K-League, pretty decent pace, and then we ended off with Wagoon at left back. We move swiftly over to the midfield which contains of gold, 86 pace, 70 dribbling, 5 star weak foot, then we have ranking at CDM spot, just great overall stats for a bronze and then we have Seung Hee at center uh, central defensive midfield uh, you know 80 pace um, and then Hyuk at the other cam just also very solid stats for a bronze player and to end the squad off we had the two strikers maybe you saw them coming maybe not but at least we have Sifzi as our first striker 81 pace 60 shooting pretty tall dude also could head the ball into the back of the net then we have Kang Su in 90 pace 4 star skiller pretty decent heading on him too as well but yeah Let's uh, get into the highlights of this team. So let's talk about the squad a bit and let's start with the formation. 4-2-2-2 two, two, two is a formation that I'm not very comfortable when it came to other teams. But with this team, this bronze team, it just worked perfectly. I mean the players just felt like they were made to play 4-2-2 two, two, in all honesty. It was that great. I mean I didn't even have to focus on the games I played with this team to be successful that good was this formation with this team so how did the players in the squad play i mean the goalie the polish goalie sir Sniak, or however you pronounce it name uh, he was solid i mean i didn't really see him too much since he only got three shots on him and uh, let in one of them but the goal he let in was uh, a header so it wasn't really a big deal i mean i rather blame the defenders for not helping him out there because you can't really blame the goalie for headed goal then the defense uh, the defense pairing Yoon and um, Gunning great solid central defensive midfielders Wong and uh, what was his name Fowler at right back uh, just did what they had to do because they didn't get too much to do actually uh, they just got a lot of help from the midfield and uh, I mean the midfield maybe that was the brightest point of this team and the attack was great too but the, the midfield just just did pretty much anything I mean they helped out in the defense so the, the mid um, the defense didn't have too much to do <laughs> because the midfield really blocked off uh, the the offense uh, offensive tries from the from the opposite team and they just the CDM's ranking and the uh, what was his name Seung Hee Seung Hee uh, great CDM's complemented each other very well and just fo found you know great passes uh, great balls over to the camps and that uh, and the uh, strikers and really creating a lot of offense gold great great player 86 pace 70 dribbling a five star weak foot i mean you can't go wrong with that for a bronze player and then Hugh, um, he did a lot of assists really play those uh, balls over the top to uh, kang Suil and sifzi and then kang Suil and sifzi just great offensive pairing uh complementing well Sissy with the power and the strength and the Kang Suil with the finishing and the, and the skills and same for Sifty Fasa but I really recommend this team to you because as you can see it's a winning squad. Let's take a look at the stats of this team. So we played four games and we won four and lost nil. Then the goal difference was a plus 13. We scored 14 goals and let only in one. Top goal scorer of the team was Sift C with his six goals on four games. Then the top assist makers in this case was Kang Su Il and Hyuk, which combined uh, both had three assists. And the standout players of this team was Kang Su Il. Great dribbler, great, great passer, and I mean, he did a lot of goals too. Sifzi, just a poacher in the penalty area, just scored probably from every chance he got. And then Gold, a very solid play at the camp, scoring two goals and making two assists. So that was the standout players, and that was the stats of the team. So let's end this video off. Thank you for watching the first episode of Squads for Cups and also the first video on my channel. It would really help if you could leave a like and maybe even subscribe and don't forget to follow me on Twitter. And as you probably could see in the beginning of the video it said sponsored by nobody. Yes, you can sponsor this series. It will be 
a video very soon and on how you can sponsor this series and bye.